Welcome guys, it is King bringing you a Black Ops 2 video on, you guessed it, Black Ops 2. Woo! Alright guys, this I'm pretty excited because this is the first Warthog that I have gotten, not from a care package, and you know, I thought it wasn't going to happen this game because I got my Stealth Chopper already and I was on the verge of getting it and you know it just didn't happen and I was I was pretty mad I was like what why is this not happening happening now I'm playing in a full party on domination and these guys are pretty 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 bad I mean they haven't even captured a up until a few seconds ago so you know you know I'm playing with lack the dude uh, rut world Kill it. Um, oh no, this is not with the full party. My bad. It's just Lack and uh, Soyo. That's it. And me. This is. I could have sworn this is was with the full party, but nope. Um. Now we're not gonna push too much in their spawn because if we do, the spawns will flip. So we're basically locking down areas, certain areas at a time. And, you know, I'm using the EMPs to my benefit. As you can see, I'm getting EMP assist, EMP assist very often. And I'm like, no, calling in my style chopper right there. I thought I hit far enough. That was my, like, I was like, I'm so close to my warthog. And I think I have one more death in the game. I go 33 and 3. So, you know... I just have one more death, and right now it, I'm seven, eight, and two. So I'm I do pretty good in this game. I'm pretty pumped, you know. I think that the stealth chopper does benefit a lot, and right now, since two of the regular whatever you want to call them, like joined and decided to go on caps A. You know, we're all kind of worried because now enemies are spawning everywhere. We don't have a straight spawn point. And, you know, that's pretty bad that we don't have a straight spawn point because, you know, when you cap, you trip cap, they start spawning everywhere, hoping that the team will get a, a flag as they do see. So now things switched. And, you know, like I said, I'm I'm locking down areas because I don't want to press too far in their spawn. Because if we press too far in their spawn, it flips. And right here, I go AFK for a little bit, which is away from controller. And then as soon, like it was just lucky timing when I got back that the guy pops out. But the reason why is because I had to let my dog out real fast, so like he was kind of like whining to go out. So I let him out, but um, like I said, luckily I came back at the right time, and um, you know, I'm just letting everything have its way. I'm just not pressing too far in. I'm not doing too much. I'm just trying to stay what I need to and doing what I need to and, you know, trying to get the kills exactly when I need them because I do need my style chopper and I do need everything else in order to benefit and right now um, 14 and 2 so right now I'm 7 I have a 7 KD and you know capping flags does benefit you a lot and right there I, I completely like run around there was no teammates around me the reason why I ran around was because I needed I needed to stay on my score streak and you know I I got in on you know I really need my score streaks to keep on rolling and be smooth and I noticed that the other gun you know I know someone's in there and my MP indicator went off which is very beneficial because you know you could check and get a feel for the different rooms that you need and there's my stealth chopper with like just a few more seconds and then i get stuck so like 
twice uh, and right there I was pretty much like raging I was like no how could this happen how could I you know I just so close to getting my warthog again I needed like 200 more points which I would have gotten on the on the next cap of B which I'm like ah oh. so this new round starts I'm like at least I have a stealth chopper in the bag which isn't too bad I mean I get three stealth choppers this game and a warthog so that's that that that's really good but you know gunning for height score streaks could be very stressful at times it's not it's not a walk in the park as everyone thinks it is it's it's hard to get high score streaks sometimes it's it's not as easy because it the game usually likes to mess with you it likes to say hey look i'm one away from a Orbital, I'm one away from a swarm or a warthog, and you know it sends everything to kill you. It'll send it's, it'll send the hunter killer drone. It'll send the lightning strike, the hailstorm, an RC car. You know it'll it'll send a lot of things your way in order for it to stop your score streak. And it just always seems you have a red dot painted on you when your score streak happens so it's just very very stressful and I'm like if I cap C I'll be able to get it nope there's too much people there luckily my style chopper killed him because I don't know if I would have finished him off I'm like okay let me get back in the safety of my fellow I guess team and I don't know why a lot of people like to be in the blue room the blue room is like the blue room of death. I wouldn't recommend going in there. Because if you go in there, you're most likely going to die. And as you see, I'm mainly staying on the on the right side. Or the right side of A, the left side of C. Depending on how you look at it. Away from the opposite of the blue room. Because the blue room seems to be the blue room of death more than anything. When you're playing on slums. So... Right now, 28 and 3, my style chopper, call it in, pick up this kill. I need one more kill, and you know, I'm just waiting. One more, like, I'm just spamming everything, hoping that I get a UAV, EMP, another um, style chopper, trying to get my score. And I see that there's a guy over there, and luckily he. I don't know what happened, he just stood there, and I'm happy, I got my Warthog. You know, this is my first Warthog, very, very happy. I've got my Orbital, my AMP systems already, I've gotten all of that. And, you know, I call in my Warthog because the game's about to end, and, you know, there's not a lot of people left, three people. I'm 36 and three. You know, it's kind of disappointing that, you know, everyone leaves the game once you call in a Warthog. Because, you know, I did work kind of hard for it, you know. I was almost on my Warthog three times already. It's, I was close, very, very close. And, you know, I think Black Ops should penalize more for people who leave the game. Because, you know, a lot of people do need to be punished for leaving because... It's not fair to those guys who do try and do get warthogs, swarms, dogs, for them to just leave and the lobby never fills up in time because this kill streak is gone. And, you know, kill streaks, you know, my warthog only got four or five kills. Dogs get four or five kills, but you need 16, 14, 15 kills to get them. I mean,. You know, that's not very beneficial at all. And I think Black Ops should refill the, either refill the lobbies faster, but then who wants to get in a game where you're losing badly? Or, you know, Black Ops should just, I honestly think, demote people because it's not fun to try to get a swarm and no one's there for your swarm to kill anyone. 
Please, guys, like, share, comment. Please share, share, share. I need this channel to really take off now. I, I really haven't stressed. I really haven't done anything about, you know, expanding my channel except putting it on the PlayStation Network little thing, my comment. But please, guys, please, please, please share, like, thumbs up. Because the more you share, the more you like, the more subscribers I will get. I need subscribers now. I haven't. I need them. All right, guys. Peace out. This is King. Thank you. Thank you, my followers. Ha, ha, ha. Catch you later. Be back soon.